What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. That's all of a sudden, age what, 60? He's just gonna break bad? Charleston White, man. Tripping on these truck drivers out here. So I guess, uh, I guess it's my turn. Everybody on TikTok is, is definitely jumping on this dude right here. Now, this guy, uh, shock jock, shock influencer. It's only a few videos that I have seen of him. You know, he, he, he talks heavy about, you know, rappers all the time. And I, I, I do agree with this guy on, on, on some points, you know, I do agree with him, but only know this, that this is his opinion, right? This is his opinion. And I, I guess that it all started because he was upset with somebody else. And then he just went on this power rant about, about truck drivers. But it, but it all started from a dude that he just made into a truck driver. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. Yeah, nigga say, man, what's up with your boy? Whoever this bitch ass nigga is, nigga, what's up with your boy? Nigga, what's up with you, bitch? Yeah, why you worried about me? Nigga, I done damn near touch a million dollars doing this shit. You whole ass nigga broke, sitting around. God, nigga, go to work, drive a truck, pussy. Truck driving ass nigga. Yeah, you bitch ass truck driving ass nigga, nigga. Fuck you bitch ass nigga, nigga. Yeah, I'm just, what's up with you, nigga? Fuck you truck driving ass nigga, nigga. Bitch ass nigga, I hate all, all you so-called G niggas, nigga. You niggas is pussy G niggas to me, nigga. Ho ass. So, I, I don't think he was, like, going off on truck drivers as a whole. I mean, it probably went that way, in, uh, you know, the farther he got into his rant. But initially, his focus was on somebody else. And he just kind of spurred it into a truck driver thing. Bitch, hey, what's up with you, your boy? Nigga, fuck you and whatever I'm supposed to be up with. Ain't now one your whole ass nigga do nothing. Yeah, bitch ass nigga. All you nigga calling Joe Blow, nigga. Say, nigga, come nigga bump into me over here, nigga. I bet you won't say a motherfucking thing to me, nigga. Now I want you whole ass nigga. Bitch ass nigga. Yeah, I'm sick of you whole ass nigga. Yeah, watch me, bitch ass Rob, nigga. Whoever you is, nigga, keep watching me, puss ass nigga. Worried about what the fuck I got going on. Ain't now one you whole ass nigga do nothing. Ain't now one you bitch ass nigga do a motherfucking thing, but call Joe Blow. Nigga, I done diss Truman Street Bloods. Nigga, I done diss Gangster Crips. Nigga, I done diss. Now, I just want to pull back for a minute. <laughs> it's the internet. You know, it, it is what it is, man. This is what you guys watch. This is the same thing when, when beef happens between drivers in, in the trucking industry. But as we come to realize in real life, talking is one thing. Pulling a gun and taking a nigga, taking a brother out is another. Every mother, all you, you niggas is beneath me, nigga. Get, get up and take your bitch ass to work, you goddamn bomb ass nigga, while I wake up and talk my way to the top, nigga. I get rich talking, nigga. Break your back, nigga. Get up and let that white boy and that Mexican treat your bitch ass. So drive them trucks, nigga, and piss in that cup, nigga. Truck driving ass, puss ass, nigga. I'm talking to you truck driving, nigga. All field working ass, bomb ass, nigga. Nigga, I make way more money than all field, nigga. Shut y'all bitch ass up talking, nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck a truck driving ass, nigga. You niggas ain't making no money driving them trucks. You bitch ass niggas doing bad. You better not be no owner operator. I look down on you dumb ass truck driving ass nigga. Bitch ass nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I look down on you dumb ass truck driving ass. I think a truck driving nigga is a retarded ass convict nigga that can't do nothing better with his motherfucking life. Ain't no truck driving nigga better living better than me, nigga. I wake up to do nothing, nigga. Drive that truck across the land, bitch ass truck driving nigga. Yeah, yeah, drive. Woo! Like I said, I mean, it, it, it pretty much started off on somebody that he was, 
that he was beefing with, but now he made it into a whole truck driving rant, boy. Mm. I mean, he did make a point of saying that, you know, a lot of truck drivers are felons and, you know, stuff like that, man. But, I mean, truck trucking as a whole has opened up a lot of, uh, uh, a lot of opportunities, man. I mean, just like you opened up an opportunity of just running off at the mouth, my guy, and getting paid for it, trucking has opened up a lot of opportunities for these dudes that was on their last leg and needed something to protect, I mean, needed something to take care of their family, bro. Their family, man. A lot of these truck driving people out here, bro, they, they're not, they're not would you, they're not who you say they are. Some of them are honest to God, hardworking, family driven people, man. You think we want to come out here and 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 drive eleven hours a day and sleeping in different cities at different uh, truck stops or or somebody's somebody's property or a, a field or on the side of the road? You think we want to do that, bro? Of course you make money just running off at the mouth, sitting down, doing all these podcasts and just being the shock jock that you are and you making all sorts of money, touching a million dollars. People don't have that luxury, dude. They just don't. They just don't. Even though you're right on some parts, you know, yeah, we, we piss in the cup. Well, at least us men do. I don't know how the women do it, but we piss in the cup. We got to we gotta drive this truck cross country. We got a fleet manager that we got to answer to. So at the end of the week, some drivers get paid well, while other drivers is still trying to make that come up. That truck across the land. You bitch ass truck driving niggas. A thought nigga kiss that white boy ass to get you a load, nigga. I ain't got to do none of that bitch ass nigga. Yeah, I'm hot. <laughs> ain't no buy, ain't no truck driver paper stacking, cause they paying they the loads is low. Nigga, everybody know the trucking industry doing bad right now. Bitch ass nigga, stop lying, ho ass. For owner operator, yeah. Yeah. But there is still some paper stacking uh truck drivers out here, bro. There's still some paper stacking truck drivers out here, man. Some of them, some of them know the business well enough to take care of themselves. So when they get in a situation right like this, when the trucking industry is doing bad, the rates is low, the fuel is high, and everything else that comes along with the trucking industry, those paper stacking drivers and owner operators know what's up. Salute to you guys, man. Salute to you guys that's doing it. Now, a lot of a lot of you, you know, that's 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 hurting, and a lot of you have to give up the trucks and 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 fall back into a company driver. Salute to you guys too. I know you guys didn't want to do it. I know it hurts. It 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 it, it hits the pride right here, right here. It hits the pride. I know. But you guys knew early to, to, to jump ship. And then y'all know to get right back on that ship when, 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 when it turns. Nigga, you all ass nigga doing bad. Nigga, the trucking industry doing bad. Fuck a bitch ass truck driver. Dick tricking ass nigga. And your bitch getting fucked. You can't please your hoe nigga. You drag that trailer while your hoe playing a pussy while you gone nigga. And you sitting that money back. A nigga like me taking her out. It's a nigga like me taking a truck driving nigga bitch out, nigga. Yeah, a truck driving nigga bitch. Now, I got a truck driving nigga bitch, and I treat her good, too, nigga. Why he gon' getting that lot lizard pussy? Getting that lot lizard pussy, nigga. Yeah, yeah, fuck a dumbass truck driver, nigga. You ain't no owner operator. You doing bad. You broke. Gas prices high, nigga. China ain't sending them. Ah, bitch ass, nigga. Fuck the truck driver crew. 
Most you bitch ass, hold on, dude, I'm ready, let me roll this up. Most you bitch ass niggas unhealthy in the motherfucker. Fat ass niggas sitting around eating that fast food. Nigga, you don't work out. You nigga drive a truck. These niggas drive a truck five days a week and don't work out none. Sitting around sleeping, eating unhealthy, eating chips, drinking soda, drinking Red Bull. These niggas ain't going to the doctor. Fat, unhealthy motherfucking truck driver. You bitch ass niggas don't live long. <laughs> mm. Good points. Good points there, Charleston. You, good points. Excellent points. You know, there are drivers out here that don't eat healthy. There are drivers out here that, that drives 11 hours and don't do nothing. I, I, I can safely say that I, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm part of that. But I don't drink Red Bull, though. I, I, don't, I don't drink Red Bull. I don't drink energy drinks. I implore my drivers not to not to do that. But I under, I understand why some of you guys do that though. Um get out, walk around. There's some healthy alternatives that's that's making their ways in the truck stops now. Um, you know, so I mean there's things that we can do, you know, there's things that we can do. And and you probably might be right, Charleston, you know, a truck driver's life expectancy is is kind of low because there's truck drivers aspiring every day in the trucks in the trucks man it's sad it's heartbreaking but you know is it is what it is this commodity still needs to be moved stuff like like you enjoy like that like that fat ass trunk chain that you got on your neck. Got to be moved by a truck. The clothes that you're wearing on your back got to be moved by a truck. Car that you, the nice car that you're driving got to be moved by a truck. The equipment that you use to run off at the mouth got to be delivered by a truck, bruh. There's no respect. There's none. And I, I did not expect you or anybody else to give us any. But listen here, though. There's going to come a time. It may not be in my lifetime. But there's going to come a time where all these truck drivers are going to finally, finally get sick and tired of being disrespected by the non by, by non drivers that don't know what goes into what we doing and they're going to say fuck it let's put the world on watch right now big cheese got it locked boy want you to let me all night yeah take me down want you to make me real way yeah swim around want you to take it like a g and i'm